Hello everyone, uh, how are y'all doing? Uh, there's a new trailer out for Ravels 2. So a year ago, uh, the game was released, revealed, and other than uh, shields, we don't know much about it. I, I guess, given finding game mechanics, having a shield can mean a lot of things. But now we have a more, I guess, in-depth look at the game. It's not just two Zetter burns on one stage. So it was revealed today in the Rivals Direct for April 1st. And the game looks much better than it did a year ago. Like this looks really good. So let me explain to you how Rivals worked. Uh, in order to get how some of these new mechanics are significant. There are no ledges, and there are no shields, and there are no throws. Instead, you kind of have to work harder to get back on stage, and the game's defensive mechanics had you either parry or perish. And then the offense is like build-a-bear combos, and the offense doesn't seem to change here. From just the small glimpse of gameplay we got here, it's just defensive mechanics. So here we got our shields back. Instead of a shrinking bubble, instead it's a, a glass bubble that's shattering. And ledges, yeah. Grabs and throws. And raster. And by the way, this game looks really good. It's well animated, the VFX look cool. It's a big step up from like the game's original 8-bit visuals. It looks really high. Pivot grabs are back because the game does not have uh, character collisions. Now on the topic of shields, given that Rivals of Aether is more parry-centric than Smash Brothers is, and emphasizes shields less than other platform fighters, I wonder if shields will still be less good than it is in Smash, and it's going to be more limited. The game can still revolve around parry mechanics, but still having a shield will help beginners get into the series, and stuff like that. Damn. The game looks really cool. And there it is, 2024. Uh, I won't worry about the game not releasing like soon soon because we have all sorts of stuff coming out before Rival 2 does. Uh, KOF 15 just came out, so did Persona. We're getting TNF Duel, we're getting Project L, we're getting Street Fighter 6, we're getting Mortal Kombat 12, we're getting all sorts of fighting games. Oh yeah, Freemaker is coming out this year as well, in Early Access. So yeah, there's so many fighting- and Multiverses too. Yeah, there's so many fighting games coming out this year, so... I won't worry about a 2024 release date. The developers can take their time. That's it for this video, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Have a nice day!